Hello, everyone. I wanted to show you one of the easiest ways to be able to download a GIF um, to be, you know, put into a, an email, social media, or maybe your own email marketing. So there are many ways to do that on um, social media. There are, are GIF keyboards that you can download from Tenor, it's T-E-N-O-R. Um, but what I like to do is search for maybe a little bit better GIF on Giphy. Um, so those are usually G-I-P-H-Y dot com. And here's an example. So let's say you want to do a reaction GIF. And uh, one of the things that people are relating to right now is Schitt's Creek. So we're going to look at some Schitt's Creek GIFs. So we don't want one with sound. Because a lot of times you won't be able to hear the sound when it's played on social media. So we're going to go without the clips. We're going to just do these, like maybe one or two of these, because there's so many good ones. Uh, so first of all, I love Alexa's face there. She's just like, what? No way. But what I really love is Moira. Um, she's my hands, like, hands down favorite character in the show. Um, because She's so dramatic. I mean, that is her job. She's an actress. Uh, but she is amazing so we're gonna narrow this down just a little bit she's got some great words that she uses some of them are like that can't be a real word but it is apparently um so i really love that i'm networking because this one you can use when you're talking to people about like why you're on linkedin or um why you're going to an event and obviously they know you're networking but like her face and like everything for her reaction is wonderful so we're really share this. Um, now, in order to um, upload a GIF, a lot of times you have to do a save image as, and then you want an actual GIF. Um, so for here, it definitely works that way. So we're going to say, this is one way to get them. Moira, I'm networking. I always try to save them like what they are, so I remember. <laughs> Um, and then I always try to save them in one spot. So right now I'm just putting it on my desktop, but I actually have a folder um, on my desktop called reaction gifts. And it's just easy for me to be able to find them uh, for emails, sometimes for, to respond to coworkers if it makes sense, or if I want to have like an eye catching email um, that I need people to read the rest of the email, I'll put a gif at the top and I'll say read below for the, the information or read below for, you know, the news you won't want to miss, things like that. Okay. So another way to do this is if you were to share this and you copy this, or just paste it up here to see what it is. Now, if I were to try to save, um, sorry, if I were to try to save this image from here, it's going to show up as a WebP, which honestly is so frustrating because um, you can't open it up, you can't share it, you can't do anything with it. Uh, but one of the easiest ways to change that is to go from media. So you just leave the entire URL the way it is, but then you change media to I. So it's i.giphy.com and then again, leave the rest of the URL alone. The only thing you're changing is media to I. Now, presto magic, when you go save image as, shows up as a GIF. So again, those are the two separate ways to get um, a GIF from Giphy directly. The first way is right in here to save image as, and it should show up as a GIF. Sometimes it shows up as a WebP there. If it does show up as a WebP there, you click on share, copy that link, paste it up here, and change media to I. So instead of media dot, it's I dot. Leave the rest of the URL alone, click save as, and you're gonna get a GIFy, or every time you're gonna get a, a GIF. So that is, the way that you want to go, um, remember, WebPs are not your friend. You can't share them. They're useless to you. And that's not what you want in life. You want things that are useful. So some useful marketing tips. I hope you all use GIFs and um, I hope you use them well. All right. Thanks a lot.